Pico Stitch There are many variations of Pico Stitch, so follow instructions by designer. The first two examples involve chain alone. For version 1, start with chain 3. Insert hook back into same main stitch and single crochet 1 stitch. For version 2, start with chain 3. Insert hook back into same main stitch and slip stitch 1 stitch. Left is chain alone with slip stitch 1, right is chain alone with single crochet 1. Next two examples involve working into first chain from the main stitch. For version 3, start with chain 3. Insert hook into first chain from main stitch, then proceed to single crochet 1. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the same main stitch. For version 4, start with chain 3. Insert hook into first chain from main stitch, then proceed to slip stitch 1. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the same main stitch. Two examples on left involve working into first chain while two on right involve just chain alone. Next two examples involve working into second chain from hook. For version 5, start with chain 3. Insert hook into second chain from hook, then proceed to single crochet 1 stitch. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the same main stitch. For version 6, start with chain 3. Insert hook into second chain from hook, then proceed to slip stitch 1 stitch. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the same main stitch. Left is slip stitch 1 into second chain from hook, while right is single crochet 1. Next two examples involve completing in the next main stitch. For version 7, start with chain 3. Insert hook into second chain from hook, then proceed to single crochet 1 stitch. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the next main stitch.
4 version 8, start with chain 3. Insert hook into second chain from hook, then proceed to slip stitch 1 stitch. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the next main stitch. Two examples on left involve completing in next stitch, while on right in same stitch. Another variation of pico stitch is a double crochet pico stitch. Start off with double crochet one stitch. Chain two then single crochet one into second chain from hook. Finish off with double crochet in the same main stitch. Double crochet pico stitch done. Next variation is long pico stitch. Start with chain 5. Insert hook into first chain from main stitch, then proceed to single crochet 1. Then finally end off with single crochet 1 in the same main stitch. From left to right, long pico and wide double crochet pico. Some ways to use pico stitches include pico edging. Combining pico stitch with a cluster stitch can produce a conical shape for amigurumi. See more about Pico stitches at the link in description at pocketyarnlings.com. Learn more amigurumi shaping tips with this free starter guide.